A 72-year-old woman abducted and raped while walking to a West Dallas bus stop more than 10 years ago got justice today. Suspected serial rapist 32-year-old Albert Ayala got the maximum sentence under law. As Fox 4's James Rose tells us, during the punishment phase of the trial, prosecutors wanted jurors with presented jurors with four other women. They say Ayala brutally raped during that same time period. James, it's just an awful story. Well, I can tell you, Heather, these victims told jurors how Alaya used guns, knives, physical force, and threats to violently rape them. And it was powerful DNA evidence that gave weight to their words. Now, jurors deliberated right through lunch and within four hours had a unanimous decision giving him a life sentence. It's a special kind of darkness. Dallas County Prosecutor Leighton D'Antoni reminded jurors of the sexual assault case they found 32-year-old Albert Ayala guilty of on Wednesday. 72 years old, he testified from a wheelchair right in front of you about how she was snatched in the dark. Prosecutors say Ayala's criminal resume began as a juvenile and demonstrates he is dangerous, violent, remorseless, and indiscriminately evil. He's Drake and old, younger, white, Hispanic, African American. Think about that. Think about how dangerous of a mind that must be. During the punishment phase, four women testified that Ayala raped them as well. Three of them have yet to see justice. Ayala's attorney, Philip Hayes, claimed his client is mentally ill and blamed his years of drug use and being in and out of jail as a juvenile. So, everything you see here. As bad as it sounds, as bad as it seems, is surrounded by drug use. Now, Ayala is already serving a prison sentence for aggravated robbery and still has several years left on that charge. Now, Judge Brandon Birmingham ordered Ayala's life sentence uh, to be started right after he finishes serving those several years on his current sentence. Now, the Dallas County District Attorney's Office says it will pursue justice in the other three aggravated rape cases against Ayala, despite that life sentence. Heather? All please. right, James Rose in our newsroom. Thank you.